My name's Jane Hardy. Um, my role is Area Sales Manager for um, a company called Lindactra International. So I got into the steel work sector. Um, I was quite interested from a very young age in maths and science, particularly physics. Um, I carried that through throughout my school career and obviously when it came to university engineering was an obvious choice. Um, it's still largely underrepresented by women, but it never it never occurred to me that my gender would hold me back in terms of learning and understanding engineering. And from there, I kind of fell into the steelwork industry um, in particular and construction because it just used my talents in engineering that I'd learnt throughout my degree. Okay, during my time with Lindapter, I've worked on a variety of different projects around my area, but one that is um, particularly important to me and close to my heart is the work we've done on the iconic Clifton Suspension Bridge in my hometown of Bristol. Um, the bridge over 50 years ago actually had some of our fixings installed to um, connect the timber deck to the wrought iron girders. And over that 50 years, over time, the coach vaults um, actually start to deteriorate. So recently, um, we've had to design a new connection or install a new connection, and we've actually used one of our innovative self-adjusting clamps that could be used on different girder sizes throughout the project. So same sort of principle, replacing what was installed 50 years ago, but with, with a more up-to-date, more innovative clamping system. So yeah, advice I'd give to, to young girls who um, maybe don't see it as a, an industry for females is there's no there's no definition of an industry for males or females these days. If you enjoy the STEM subjects, if you've got a talent for them, pursue that and there's no barrier. Your gender isn't a barrier to succeeding within steelwork or indeed any other industry within construction.